Alright, what's going on guys? I am bringing you a 176 and 2 demolition gameplay on standoff. And uh, I think you guys, for the most part, should have seen something to this effect before. I uploaded that 200 plus on standoff, but uh, if you missed that, I'll link it. I, I'm pretty sure that's the most kills on standoff. But anyway, that's not really that important. Um, in this gameplay, I get a 115 gun streak, and I also get a 161 kill streak. So, lots of high-ass uh, streaks, I guess, in this gameplay. I'm also using the Peacekeeper. And uh, I probably would actually go to 200 plus if I wasn't using the Peacekeeper, and I'll go into that in a second. But if we could try to hit 500 like ratings for this video, that would be much appreciated. Um, I believe this is the second highest gun streak in Black Ops 2. Um... Pretty sure it's second highest. I know the highest without spawn trapping is 103, but I believe there's a few higher ones with spawn trapping, of course. So, uh, it's still one of the highest, so pretty cool. It's, it is my highest gun streak as well, and uh, that's always cool. I finally got it. You know, I always wanted to get that 100 gun streak, and uh, finally got it in this gameplay. So, that's pretty cool. So, yeah, if you could leave a like rating for that, it would be much appreciated. But, um, as far as class ups and stuff go, you saw me using the Peacekeeper in that first round. Then in the second round, I go over here to the hammer, but here's the problem. Um, this class didn't have scavenger on it. Um, I was using the wrong setup. I didn't have my standoff setup going, so I had to use my nuketown setup, which I used toughness. And therefore, you see, I run out of ammo. I had to pick up uh, a SMG. And this was a really ugly one, too, but if I wasn't using an SMG, you know, if I had my normal LSAT with scavenger on it and extended mags, I probably could have got an extra... 30 kills and got that 200 plus who knows maybe even like the highest gun streak but uh it's all good it's all good i still got the 100 gun streak that was basically just my goal and uh i think that's it as far as gun streaks go i'm not going to really go for any more gun streaks i just wanted to get one above 100 and uh now i'm going to just go to try to get the quad nuclear maybe a penta nuclear who knows that's going to be my next goal to achieve and uh that should be pretty good i think i think i can do it Let's see, in this gameplay, I got 115 gun kills, so what, four, five kills away from, well, actually, I did also, I, I in this gameplay, I actually got like 130 gun kills. Um, I started out 17 and 2, I believe, something like that, yeah. No, 15 and 2, I don't know, something like that, anyway. Um, you won't see any deaths in this, because uh, I started out the game with two deaths, I never died after that. But... I've got like 130 gun kills on this, so I got enough gun kills actually to get um, a quad nuclear. Not enough to get a penta. 150 gun kills in a game is very hard to do. And you know what I really regret because in the beginning of the game, when we used to do hardcore CTF, um, we used to just go for kills. I didn't go for nuclears um, because I easily could have gotten like probably a septa nuclear <laughs> um because you know me and astro both had that 300 plus dual 300 plus game i probably got 10 nuclears in that gameplay 300 kills i went like 330 and like 10 or something astro went 394 and 11 so i think we pretty much both got like 10 nuclears in that game something like that so um that just happened to be back before anyone cared about nuclears and i wasn't going for nuclears but I could have easily got a, like a crazy nuclear gameplay in that, and uh, obviously can't do that anymore. So it is what it is. But actually, I might, <laughs> I might go back to that gameplay and count the nuclears. Who knows? I might have actually got some sort of crazy record. I, I don't really know. It's not that big of a deal to me, honestly. So it's whatever. But that's pretty much all I got to say with the gameplay. Um, just future videos. I got a couple more videos coming up soon. Um. I'm going to upload this Nuketown Trap, Nuketown CTF Trap, Triple Nuclear, plus 29,000 score. I was like 600 score off the score cap, 30k. So that's that should be pretty cool. You guys should enjoy that. I'm number one right now for CTF. That's cool. And then Smacking Sweaties will also be coming up. Um, the final game, game three. And then after that, I'm not really sure what I'm going to upload. I might upload some more multi-team. And, uh, I think that should be good for now. Um, probably just gonna upload a lot more Smacking Sweaties, because you guys really like that series. And right here, I switched back to the Peacekeeper, because I had Scavenger on it. Oh, I don't know if I said this. The reason I was using the Peacekeeper was because, uh, 
I was trying right there. You see, I unlocked an extended clip. I was trying to get it maxed out all the way, and uh, that's pretty much it. I don't like the Peacekeeper really. It's it's a decent gun, but nothing special. It's pretty. It hits pretty weak. That's why I don't really like to use it, because this game is so connection based. Uh, you need a strong gun. You don't want to be using a gun that isn't very strong. So not a big fan of the Peacekeeper, but it's a decent gun. Nothing completely wrong with it, but. I was just using it to rank it up, and then I wanted to uh, delete that map pack. The only map pack I'm, I have currently is the studio one. Um, I deleted this Peacekeeper one. Uh, well, not whatever. What are the maps? I don't even remember the maps that were on this map pack. That's, it was like down, okay, downhill grind. Yeah, those ones. Um, I don't really like any of those maps, so that one's deleted. But you still get to keep the Peacekeeper for whatever reason, even after you delete the map pack. I don't know why that is. I think it's like some sort of glitch with the uh, game but right here you see there's only two people in the game and uh, man you know if people would connect to the game and if I had an OMG this could easily have been a 250 plus who knows but I think one of these days man um, either on this map or on studio um, or I think that's about it I don't play Nuketown uh, demo anymore because it freezes your Xbox but either this map or studio uh, 300 plus is gonna happen man definitely for sure because it just just need to get the lobby because we got it wrapped up. But yeah, that's it. that's pretty much the end of the video. Thanks for watching, guys. Leave a like rating if you enjoyed. There's the 85 Unstoppables added to 30 is 115 Gun Streak. And peace out.